Hello everyone, and welcome to my two months top surgery. So I'm two months post up now. It is the 6th of April, and I thought I'd give you an update because at the end of this month, I'll be three months post up, and I've got to go to London and have my kind of like my post up appointment and my uh, outpatient review for Mr. Ruben. I thought I'll show you, you know progress of where I'm at two months later. So this is what my chest is looking like. Ignore how spotty I am. That is to do with my hormones at the moment. But this is two months post-op. As you can see, flat. I'm sure you will remember me highlighting this in my last video, but I have like these fattier bits around here. I also haven't been working out because obviously you're not supposed to. Um, so I haven't been working out, hence my body is not its best right now. I've also got like stretch marks coming up here, but I've got stretch marks here from uh, building muscle, I think it is, because it's quite solid there now. Um, probably using my arm too much on this side too early, uh, because I am right-handed. I thought my right side wasn't going to be good, but it's actually my best side is my right side. My left side's also nice too. I was scared the pigment wasn't gonna come back in my nipples, but it clearly has. But they actually look really good. It looks like it's not straight, but it is. It's how my body is, but it's how my chest was previously to how, you know, my scars are. I think my scars are healing really well. It did have a bit of pleating going on across the incision, but it seems to have calmed down now. And I'm getting chest hair, which is kind of strange, but I like it. I mean, I've only got a few. I'm growing a lot more hair in the center part here but i am really happy with my results and really happy with how it looks and i'm really happy i didn't wait any longer for mr nishaw i'm so much happier that i just had top surgery and mr reuben done such a good job and i'm really happy about it it's really nice to be able to wear shirts and enjoy wearing t-shirts again you know if like any trans guy when they have top surgery the white vest comes out just gonna work on my belly now my scar care routine like i have silicone strips i'm not wearing them at the moment because i need to buy some more um but i moisturize every day for half, like about 10 minutes i can't sit there and rub my scars for half an hour but everything's still quite solid there um you can feel the scar tissue it's not kind of settled properly just yet um, but I'm only two months post-op, so it's not really like it was going to settle that quick. But I do think they healed really quick. Um, Sensation-wise, some of it's back, and the sides here, I can't really feel much here. I'm not too sure why it's there more than at the front here, but it is. I don't have any sensation in my nipples, and I'm not really bothered about that. I don't think I ever did before, previous, as I probably mentioned before in my past videos. I'm really happy with my results. I'm happy to sit topless in my garden i haven't gone anywhere to be topless yet i am going abroad in september to gran canaria so hopefully i can be topless there and not worry about it and obviously cover my scars up with like silicone tape so you know you're not supposed to get your scars in the sun take care of your scars otherwise they won't fade over time and that's what i'm trying to do is take care of my skin the most um i'm sure it's weird for my family of seeing me walking around without a top on and i'll just walk around in boxes all the time but i'm really happy with how i feel and I feel so ecstatic that I had top surgery. So it's really nice to be able to do these things now that I wasn't be able to do before. Wear certain tops that I didn't wear before. And yeah, it's just amazing how much of a difference this can make to my life, which I knew it would. But it's also nice to be on the other side and receiving those benefits that I, I thought about pre-surgery. This is my results, two months post-op.